Hey, hey, and welcome back to the channel. This is going to be my reaction and spoiler-free review of the first installment of The Book of Boba Fett. I'm here with my assistant, Baby Yoda, the child, whatever name you give it, adorable. Let's just go with adorable. Um, as well as skilled and talented future Jedi. I didn't leave that out. You, I, you told me, yeah, okay, we're moving along. Uh, this one was short and sweet, 38 minutes long, uh, directed by the ever-talented Robert Rodriguez, and uh, I have to say that this this installment was just as good as The Mandalorian, um, if not better in some aspects, just because it does have so much tied to the original trilogy. Um, like I said, won't give anything away, but they the continuity in this is really great the attention to detail um the, there's a lot of respect to the lore extended as well as canon um they and i feel like in all of their series thus far they've done a really good job of kind of fixing or patching up mistakes without having to retcon anything that happened in the sequel trilogy i, I i'm really liking the road that star wars uh under the regime or reigns of Dave Filoni and John Favreau is going. They have just already given us so much in The Mandalorian and Bad Batch and Clone Wars and the things that are coming up like Acolyte, Obi-Wan Kenobi, um, the Lando series, uh, the Andor series, and much more. Uh, I have to say the sets obviously fantastic the visuals and the use of CGI um, really just on point again um, Tamira Morrison does a great job reprising his role um, he even seems like he's more in shape and more up to the task uh, which you gotta love someone who dedicates to their craft everything about his part and this show is just going to take this into amazing canon that people remember moving forward as what happens to Boba Fett after Return of the Jedi and so forth. So yeah, I give it a 9 out of 10 on that scale. I mean, I'll give it a 10 out of 10, but I don't want to rate it so high that people are thinking it's unrealistic just because I enjoy Star Wars more than a lot of other content but to be fair i just think that everything they hit on every realm um and i'm excited to see where this goes and that's just my two cents on it i'm sure if you want a little bit more in depth breakdown there's great channels with great content such as star wars theory and um nerd theory and den of nerds some of my favorite just right off the top but uh yeah may the force be with you and like subscribe and share is that, is that how you do it like, subscribe, and well, too many hands, too many fingers? Like, yeah.